above all, is it what you tend to look at is is not just a skill level, but a consistency to be able to deliver that. And that was one of the telling reasons for the majority of those boys, you know, having sort of planned or redone the plans following the the postponement of the Olympics. It was using things like the skipper and domestic sevens competitions to see those players that illustrated that they could have that consistency in the way that they played uh, and the way that they behaved on the field. And a lot of the boys that have come in from from the skipper competition, as you said, likes of Namosi and Suva, I think that both teams went particularly well through the season. Um, and I think that those players that showed the greatest consistency and a point of difference, be it physicality or be it uh, you know their tackle ability or their ability above the ball, um, to do that. 80 minutes week after week after week and that gives you some indication of what you would be looking for for them to be a good sevens player now I'm not saying it, it, it the answers are all there it's done then you bring them in here and you see how they react to being in here so yeah the majority of them are, are from skipper there's one or two that have played in domestic sevens competitions notably the they who has been playing for Damo Damo they've been going very well and you know I'm still looking at all the tournaments that we play over the coming months uh, for any other potential players that can show that level of consistency in sevens format as the likes of the boys did in their skipper.